The military has been periodically doing these types of projects. The latest group of remains that were disinterred from the cemetery here in Carlisle included nine Rosebud Sioux children as well as one Alaskan Aleut child. And the remains of the Sioux children were handed off yesterday. Yesterday morning, the Army formally transferred the remains of all nine Rosebud children to their families. That handoff concluded a weeks-long process of disinterring remains from children who died at the Carlisle Indian School and returning them to relatives separated by generations. You can't imagine someone, you know, their kids just being taken away from them and like large groups of children being taken away. Kara Curden with the Cumberland County Historical Society says the school children taken by the U.S. government were essentially stripped of their culture to assimilate into American society. In recent years, the federal government has sought to return the remains. Some people, families have tried, you know, for a very long time to get to this point. So it's wonderful to see that shift and public thinking that this is now something that, you know, the government is doing. 14 of the 164 graves that are at the cemetery are unmarked according to the U.S. Army. Most of the children that were buried here died from disease. In Carlisle, Tom Lehman, WGAL News 8.